Buddy got dickered. Oh shit. Oh boy. That'll ruin your whole day. When you dump your semi truck off the road. Oh damn. There goes more help from the pow pow. Switby Monday, welcome to the start of a glorious week. It's 1.54 p.m. on the 6th day of August 2012. Um, it's only about 80 degrees. I'm gonna try to go to the pool. I will probably freeze, but they have a hot tub. So that is good news. Uh, plenty of clouds, also plenty of blue. It looks like it's about a half and half there. Looks like an AMG product to me with the signature quad outlets. Looks like it is. It's a SLK 55 AMG being passed by M. What a surprise. No, I'm just kidding. That actually does look pretty nice. A little small for me. I'd rather have the SL65, but that's a nice car. Does this look familiar? This is the big, uh, rich, white city of Akron. Doing a two-part errand today. I have to go to Dave Walter to get that extra clip pin thing for the glove box. I'm really hoping they have one. If not, whatever, maybe I'll have to order it. That seems so stupid, though. I want it to be done right, but I don't want to spend a lot of money on a little piece of metal that is the size of a dime, if. Um, so I'm gonna try to get that, and while I'm down here south off Route 8, I'm gonna go down and look at that car. Actually, I haven't explained that to you yet. I'm looking at a car for a friend online in camp. Uh, I'll explain it in a bit. They had the M6 in there still, the blue one. Actually, it could have been a different one. I think it had a different interior. I'll have to reference the pictures I took last time. They had that, they had uh, about four M3s. Three of them had manuals. A bunch of 911s. One of them was a PDK. The other one, or the other two were manuals. Um, Nothing incredibly special, a Z3M Roadster, which I don't really like, but um, yeah, 6 Series GT. They're, they're, they're keeping a much better inventory in there than they used to, which is good. All right, just got out of Canton. I'm, uh, I'm back on 77 North. I filmed a lot there. I don't know if I'm going to put any of it in the vlog. If I did, then you already saw it. Um, but check out the E39 Source channel. I should be able to get that up tonight, providing YouTube servers aren't too dicked. And I'll get the, the walk around and ideas about that car. It's a 2000 with 101,000 miles on it, and uh, it is in rough condition. It would need somebody that buys that car with the intent to, I don't want to say restore, but restore it back to what it could be. And that's kind of what I did with this car. You know, it wasn't great. It wasn't like that. Uh, but I've put a lot of time and money into this, and I've made a, a really nice car out of it. And that's what that one needs. And a lot of it, it just needs somebody to care for it. It was so dirty, and the interior especially, it just needs some love. It needs somebody to wash it and to clean it and to vacuum it out. And uh, the, to clean the wheels and to wax it. I mean, it felt like it hasn't had a wax job, job in years. It wouldn't start, the battery was dead. Uh, lots of things like that. Nothing major seemed to be wrong with it. The check engine light was on due to about 10 codes. Uh, which I pulled, and they turned out to be mostly misfires during warm-up, so that's spark plugs. And then there were a few things, the throttle position center, and then the crankshaft position sensor uh, for the Vanos unit, which I don't know what that entails. I've never had to deal with that. But it, it needs work. And uh, I don't know if the guy that I'm working with is willing to put the time and money into it. I don't, I, don't, I don't know if he's looking to buy one as a project or if he's looking to buy one to buy and drive for 70,000 miles and not have to do anything to it. So that is what I'm going to have to talk to him about. All right, just editing today's video. It's 2.16 a.m. and I realized I forgot to tell you that I did pick up one of those clips today and I uh, got that installed really, really simple. And uh, now that is done, so that's good news. Um, got the yard mowed across the street and over a house, which was a complete bitch if I do say so. It was really high, it took forever. And I also did a, uh, a detail on the car again. If I had done this two hours ago, my finger would have been completely black. So I went over it with the Xano stuff, did everything but the wheels. I'll do those tomorrow. Got the glass done, the exhaust, everything, so that's clean now. For another week or ten days, a little high air. Uh, cleaning things up now, I'm going to work on the Watch Later playlist again tonight. Um, got stuff everywhere. I think there's seven videos in there, so that's not too bad, I guess. If you want to see the video on the car, I think I am going to make it public on E39 Source, and I'm hoping to get that up tonight. If it's not up, it'll be up tomorrow. And that's it for today. I'll talk to you tomorrow on 604. Good night.